of season. Yeah. If I don't snap it. Hey, Juice, that's good. Before we get into today's video, give us a official shout out to all the official sponsors. TheGirlSpotVA.com. GraphicSpotVA.com. Reach out to them. Uh, information is on the bottom of the screen. Sorry, a mosquito or something on me. Information on the bottom of the screen, y'all. You know, reach out to them for all your graphic needs, right? Yeah. All your graphic needs, decals, t-shirts, hats, um, promotional items, all that. Yard signs, any type of sign. They can do it for you. Our other sponsor. Innovative powders. Innovative powders. Reach out to them for all your powder coat needs. The information is going to be right and there. And sir, coating, like Peanut saying. So reach out to them. If you need anything powder coated, automotive, household, whatever it is, they can do it. All right, today's video is on our Dodge Neon SRT4. Uh, let's go into the car, Peanut, and we're going to show y'all what it's doing. Let me turn the camera around. Well, no, I ain't gonna turn it around. Let me grab the keys. How about that? You know, you can open up that door on that side if you want to. No, come around this. Go ahead. He he want to battle the thorn bushes. All right. And we just gonna talk a little bit on what's going on with my. This is my daily driver. This is what I drive to work every day. Uh, a 2005 Dodge Neon SRT4. We really don't have it on the channel a lot, but maybe I'm gonna start. Old. Yeah, it's old. Maybe I'm gonna start doing that, you know, adding this to the channel, but it's my daily driver, y'all. It has like 180,000 miles on it. Uh, it's been a great car. Yeah. Uh, you know, these cars get a bad rap, but I ain't had no, only issue I had with this car was, uh, I had to replace all the wheel burns, but, yeah. but I beat on this car. So, you know, between autocrossing and drag racing, the wheel burns uh, were shot. Uh, what else, Peanut? Uh, I had to put another radiator in it last year. If y'all look back on the channel, I think I did a video on putting that radiator in. Yeah. But we upgraded to an aluminum radiator with some new um, cooling fans. And what else? That's about it uh, with this car. Uh, I drive it every day to work. Uh me and Peanut, what, last week, we just put Freon back in it. Yeah. You know, I had to um, air up the AC, so the AC's blowing cold, y'all, uh, in this car. Because I didn't drive it for about a month because it was hot because I didn't have the Freon for the AC yet. So I just bowed down, went to the local auto parts store, got some uh, Freon R134. But what I'm going to do is turn this around to me and Peanut, and I'm going to let y'all hear what's going on with it. And then we're going to talk about that. So let me try Hear that, y'all? See the lights flickering? So, this is, let me pull this out. So, I came out one day last week to drive it, and I had left the courtesy, the vanity light, whatever you want to call these lights in the mirror on, which the battery's so low, I only think it wants to turn on. I left it on the whole weekend, so it was last Friday. Come out here, so yesterday I came out here, knowing that I drained the battery because I left the light on, I came out here and put the charger on it for about an hour and a half, two hours, and it started right up. Battery charge, whatever, whatever. But what I think is happening is, first of all, this battery is from 2016. So we got our money's worth. Yeah. 2016, it's almost, we're halfway through 2024. But I think what really did this battery in, I didn't start having problems until this heat wave hit us. So, but these batteries can go dead in hot or cold climate, hot or cold. So this battery went bad in a hot climate because back in the winter months, this battery was fine. The car start up, whatever, you know what I'm saying? But now uh, I do have a, do I got a load tester in there? I don't think so. But so 
at lunchtime at the lunch hour, I went to O'Reilly's and got a new battery for this car because I got to have my daily driver back. Got to have my daily driver back. I, especially since it got AC now, right? Yeah. Blows cold. Show them this. Show them that. That's how we know it's blowing cold. Uh, right now, it's, it's hot because we don't got it on. But, you know, I had my thermometer in there. That thing was getting down to 40, 40 degrees, y'all. So, it's blowing cold. So, me and Peanut going to go ahead and tackle this battery and install this battery. We ain't going to, uh, you know, most people know how to install batteries and all that. I don't know who is. Is somebody in our driveway? But uh, we're going to go ahead and install this battery and get it done. Uh, I might let, Peanut, you want to film? Why install the battery? Yeah, I'll do it. Okay, we're gonna let Peanut film while I install the battery. I, I'ma uh, get off this camera and I'ma go get some tools to take the uh, battery hold down bracket down and take the battery out, put the new one in, put it all back together. We're gonna be good to go, right? Yep. And Peanut gonna be behind the camera in a few minutes. All right, okay. see y'all in a couple of seconds. Let me see, that bolt? I'll put it yeah. back. If I don't snap it. Yeah. I think it's coming. Yep. Team run it. Oh, yeah. Another thing that went wrong, too. Remember I had to put the uh, valve cover gaskets, new valve cover gaskets on it? That's in the video, too, from last year, too. If y'all go back yeah. in the channel. That's in the video. Yeah, you can just hold it back, like right here. Cause I'm gonna keep hitting the camera. I don't wanna keep hitting it. Oh, yeah. Man, I do not wanna break that. It's coming out though. I don't wanna snap it, but it's coming out. I'm gonna put some anti-seize on. Oh, hear it? what happened it rusted down in there it's probably surface rust but still it'll heat up and snap on you i don't want that yeah then that's another project yeah it was fine it's just surface rust all right team run it let me go ahead and do this main negative real quick i know what i'm gonna have to do though i'm gonna have to um get a new terminal for this side that terminal's kind of a little damage right there yeah. that's all good but yeah this car been good to me man this car right here it's been rolling purchased it brand new in march of 06 this is a late august car is when they was uh winding down building these nsrt4s back in 05 this is 05 so it came with the stage one uh stage one uh injectors the bigger injectors and uh, something that, oh, it came with a limited slip in 05 too, in the transmission. So it's been a good car, it's been a good car. That's why I try to take care of it. I need to, I almost thought about restoring this car back to its glory, like getting a new dash pad and all that. But we'll see. Yeah. We'll see. Show them that radiator. That's the aluminum radiator installed last year. Yeah. It's cool now, y'all. It runs super cool with that radiator. Yeah. Uh, let me take this one off. That's Man, I might have to get a watch now, Peanut. Oh, it's coming. The terminal was bending a little. I'm going to get a new terminal. I'm going to have to order a new terminal for this. Yeah. Because I'm going to show Team Runner what I'm talking about with this positive terminal. Because this, I guess it holds gases or something, and you put that cover back on it. And I'm gonna show you, Peanut. You probably don't even know what I'm talking about, do you? With this terminal, I'll show it. I'll sh I show it to you. What I'm talking about, I don't know. If I can get it loose without breaking the terminal. All right, I'm gonna show y'all team run it right here. All right, hold on. This, because I greased it, I keep it clean, but the terminal uh, is broken right here. See it? Like right there, hold on. You can see it. 
if I can move my big finger thumb out the way. It's like right in there where my finger's pointing. Yeah, there you go. That's a good shot of it. It's broken right there, so I'm gonna have to order a new terminal for it. It's all good. All right, show you. All right, team running. We got her back running again. We got her back running again, y'all. Fresh new battery. NSR24. Ah, I gotta have my daily driver back, y'all. I gotta have my daily driver back. Let me check out this uh, AC first. Make sure that it's going down for me, y'all. It's going. Oh, oh I can feel it. I can feel it already. Lower than that. Gotta get you lower than that. Yeah, we back in business, y'all. Let me rev it a little bit. Oh yeah, we back, y'all. We back. Ah, I can drive it tomorrow. And also, I didn't want to uh, really. Let's say I drove it to work. I come out from work and click, click. I have to get a jump or whatever it is. I, I, I don't like that. I got to have, you know, the dependability. Like, uh, Team Run, I know y'all can agree with me on that, though. But, yep. So, we're good to go, y'all. We are good to go. 